Actress Felicity Huffman and 12 other parents pleading guilty to paying thousands of dollars to help their kids cheat their way into a seat at top universities. The dozen pleas include five parents from the Bay Area who were charged with crimes in the scandal. KPIX 5's Wilson Walker is in Stanford with those details. About a month now since this scandal broke and suddenly a wave of new developments. For starters, a student here at Stanford University has been expelled. She allegedly had falsified sailing credentials on her application. You'll remember the sailing coach was fired last month. But the other big development today, a wave of folks who plan to plead guilty in all of this, and most of them are parents. The most famous among those pleading guilty actress Felicity Huffman accused of paying scandal mastermind Rick Singer $15,000 for her daughter's participation in the college entrance exam cheating scheme. Now today Huffman released a statement saying quote, I am in full acceptance of my guilt with deep regret and shame over what I have done and my daughter knew absolutely nothing about my actions. Her pleading guilty at this early stage shows that she does indeed have remorse. It was very, very smart. Now there were a handful of guilty pleas in the Bay Area today as well. Anything to say about your daughter? Did she know what was going on? Was she involved at all? Napa Vintner and San Francisco resident Augustin Hunesis, he is said to have paid Singer $300,000 to get his daughter in both the entrance exam and the athletic recruiting schemes. There will be two guilty pleas from Menlo Park as well. Marjorie Clapper accused of paying $15,000 for a bogus entrance exam for her son. Peter Sartorio will plead guilty for doing the same for his daughter. And finally, Bruce and Davina Isaacson of Hillsboro. They will plead guilty to using the college recruitment scheme for both of their daughters and the entrance exam scheme for one of them. For that, they allegedly paid Singer $600,000 partly in Facebook stock through an attorney the Isaacsons released this statement quote no words can express how profoundly sorry we are for what we have done our duty as parents was to set a good example for our children and instead we have harmed and embarrassed them by our misguided decisions we have also let down our family friends colleagues and our entire community we have worked cooperatively with prosecutors and will continue to do so as we take full responsibility for our bad judgment now, a critical point about the Isaacson case, he was facing a complaint from the IRS accused of underpaying his taxes by calling the bribery payments charitable contributions. Now, remember, one school of thought in all this is that most of the parents will not be facing prison time. The IRS complaints, the tax fraud, that could, of course, lead to something in the ballpark of a couple months in prison. So obviously, he has good reason to cooperate there. Sentencing in these cases will be up to respective judges at the Stanford University campus. Wilson Walker, KPIX 5.